Eevee is ready to evolve and evolve into Leafy Young. Panko is ready to evolve and let's press evolve. And yeah. we have a Raichu we have to capture. And yes, I will go over everything in my inventory here in a second. Alolan Raichu, get over here, get over here. Let's get back onto this Alolan Raichu business and everything that's in the inventory. So I'm pretty sure I'm 99% positive. I still have the footage from me discovering what happened. I just don't remember if I have audio for it or not. So I'll go ahead and play that. And what that was was obviously someone leaving me something at the time I don't remember remember doing it because this was like a week and a half after that was recorded technically but thank you absolutely so much so we have all of that going on so we actually have so much stuff we have a master ball we have quick balls great balls we have lucky candy rare candy i mean not lucky candy diamonds a judgment day and then on top of that this was all from one chest from one person so thank you so much for that and then we have a treat going on party that we really need to discuss as well and one other pokemon which i haven't checked out but i'm suspicious i know where my greninja came from and i think think that's where these guys came from too maybe not the same person but i'm pretty sure these were pokemon given to me i don't know if you can check original ownership or not yes we caught the rolling right in this i'm assuming you should be able to catch the original oh and we also have a dragon scale and two exp shares duh all right so first of all i want to check can we see the original owner of this there's no way this was just happened to be in my pc after i logged back on right there's no, no this had to be a given to me the reason i say that is i also had this suspiciously perfect IV Greninja, just like the Trico is. The Trico is 31 in everything except for special attack with an adamant nature, which makes no sense because technically Trico is a special attacker, but he learns almost no special attacking moves outside of Leaf Storm and Absorb. And now there's this Spirit Tomb. I haven't checked the Spirit Tomb's IVs yet, but oh look, I'm in shock. 100% IV. So I have absolutely no idea who gave me these Pokemon. I thank you very, very much and I hope you enjoy this series and I really, really appreciate you giving me Trico, you had to have known that Trico is one of my favorite start is my favorite starter. Okay, now that we're home, we have our EV evolution stones, right? Okay, we have a shiny stone and a dust stone. Not great for us. Okay, right, so first of all, I want to go ahead and take one of the EVs that we have here. And because this is Cobblemon, I'm pretty sure we can just use a leaf stone and get Leafy on, I think. Yes, there we go. Eevee is ready to evolve and evolve into Leafy on easier than the actual searching for the grass and ice stones, like in the other Pixamon, which I don't know how I feel about it. Technically, I like it because it makes sense, but at the same time, so there we go. A nice little leaf, you know, it's pretty good. And if you haven't checked it out, by the way, I don't think the video has come out yet for the speed building, but we do have all of this over here, which is the water battlefield, which is actually really, really nice looking, actually. I'm super happy with it. If I remember correctly, back here was where we found the original chest. Aha, just, just in case I didn't have the footage. Yep, hi Carson, I love to make your videos you make on the server. I thought I'd leave you a little gift. I love the content, keep it up. Okay, so it was Keegs, PS you should get a Dratini and let it hold the DS. DS, 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 DS. What was the DS? Now, I'm, I'm gonna leave the sign in the chest there because honestly, I really like it. Why not leave it? And once I have enough claim blocks, I'll just put it in the claim. DS, DS. Harder C isn't DS, though. That wouldn't make any sense for abbreviations. So, if you could let me know what you meant in the comments down below, Keeks, I would really, really appreciate that. And absolutely, thank you so much for all of that. And thank you once again to everyone who actually sent me everything. I really appreciate it. But our main goal for today is our Pineco, who's shiny. Pinecos are main focus today because it's shiny and I would actually appreciate evolving it because shiny fortress would be cool. Plus, why wouldn't we want to actually uh, trade and evolve a shiny? I don't know why we wouldn't want to evolve a shiny. So that's what we- Oh, we still have our wonder trade of the episode we need to do. With such a crazy start, I completely forgot about wonder trading for today. I still need to make some dust balls. I'm getting some green apple corn stocked up, just not as fast as I would like, probably because I don't pick them as often as I should. Oh, that's super exciting. The owner of the server, he's currently testing legendary spawning. That is super cool. So I got really excited when I saw that, but I'm glad it's to know it's a test. And that actually makes me feel a lot better about having a Master Ball now. Because I was like, what are we going to use it for if there's no legendaries? Sorry, Sneasel. I have Weavile. So you are the perfect Wonder Trade slash Wonder Trade. Let's see what we get today. And we got our, ooh, not an uncommon Pokemon at all. But something I just haven't caught yet, Bergmite. Avalog is actually a decent Pokemon. Nothing crazy, though. I think he's more of a defensive Pokemon, so not really my style. It's weird to think there are specific styles of like pokemon battling all right so i think we need to get to level 31 to have pineco actually fully evolve into our fortress which shouldn't be all that bad we're only level 28 actually should we have rare candies but do i want to waste rare candies on that i actually think i'd rather just save them for the high levels all right so there's one thing i've realized i don't like about my base as much as i love each and every single one of these walls i don't have a proper way in and out anymore because of them you know at least they're very pretty looking that's why i feel like this is probably some of my best building i still want to fix the house because some 
something with that i like the terrace being there and i like the design of it but it doesn't go with the house it's too big for the house it's totally not built specifically for thumbnails that, that's totally not why I, I didn't build that specifically just so i would have a better thumbnail location all right well rtp always gives us higher pokemon levels so let's go for it Whew, we finally would not teleport into the water that's nice i also really appreciate that we have slash pc so we can actually switch out pokemon whenever we want it's kind of sad i don't have some pokemon like ponyta yours i should definitely have you i should definitely have you as well oddish but that's okay we'll we'll just focus on training you guys for now wow i only pay back and roll out that's not a great move set to try to earn xp on his own maybe i should use the rare king i mean it's only what three it's tempting but if we find an extremely high level it just wouldn't be worth it because level 28 would get most of his xp bar just completely filled by that high level all right like level 43 here boom we go in we switch out to literally anybody any single one of our pokemon can take it i am kind of sad that some of our neater pokemon that we currently have on the team aren't like perfect because like we've just been using them for whatever so their straight up evs are so trashed out and i don't know if there's ev resets on here but that means they're also all good for breeding and i still want to know what this pokemon design is like what is it based off of oh see and that took pinko up to level 30 that was basically a level and a half from a level 42 so well we're traveling out here so we need one more level without wasting any rare candies which is a super now why would you waste the crimson blocks you know how long it takes to get these like when i got the crimson in the warp forest planks for my home like it took so long because so many people had just shredded down those forests and whatnot oh my god a level 25 bolton gave me 1400 experience wow we literally need uh, just a pokemon battle come here level 25 farfetch perfect we switch out into all oh, boy cinder ace i gotta start taking on the gym soon but that's kind of why i'm starting to you know pack up and hold up pokemon that are really high ivs and i'm not using them right away but there we go panko is ready to evolve and let's press evolve and whoo shiny fortress i don't know how i feel about that yet okay okay interesting you definitely two different shades of like yellow or gold but i don't know how i feel about it panko is one gold color made sense it was one blue shade but this is you know like a silver with red why not make two different colors for the shiny or something i guess it is because they're different shades i like it but at the same time i don't like it and i think it's the outside shell it almost feels just like a plain white when it's not it might be the brightness of the sun too ah look at the little sleepy shiny cloy or fortress i about said cloisters what's wrong with me it's a sleepy fortress who's shiny i do love that there's straight up a sleeping animation overall but that's super cool to have him fully evolved and into a shiny pokemon as well but i guess that leaves just the team left to decide what to build because soon enough we're going to be taking on gyms everybody so let me know what you guys think we should be doing with this team right here the Titan across this entire road to Trico and then just this spirit tomb those are our options so far now this Titan was an alpha Pokemon but all these Pokemon have basically the Trico the spirit tomb and I think Greninja all have better IV stat than the Titan alpha but having both Trico and Turtwig would not be great and Turtwig's a grass ground really defensive Pokemon and the only defensive Pokemon I have currently so leave a like comment and subscribe if you guys did enjoy it and let me know in the comments down below what you guys think the team should be and I'll see y'all next time Rockstar Peace, peace.